lyssna. Ska vi helt seriös? Jag har ju gått in i bandy, det är kul. Men alltså, om vi ska vara helt seriösa. Om vi är helt seriösa. Det är waiting for me. Yo, 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 what's up guys? I'm back at it again. Here's a new tutorial and let's get right into it. First off, you need to do all the basics. So sync up the clip, add your velocity and all of this basic stuff that I hope you guys already know. But when you've done that, we can get into adding the effect and it's actually very simple. Find where the impact happens or where you synced up the clip. So right here and to add the build up, just go to effects and drag in an adjustment clip. Make sure to not change the like length of it or anything like that because the preset won't work if you do. So just take the whole adjustment clip and make so it ends on um, the impact. So like I did just here. Uh, then just hover over it, go to the Fusion tab, and uh, then go over to uh, the Google Drive document in the description and download the best build-up uh, preset. Then when you download it, you can just drag it in like this. It will be no plugins, as I said, and you can connect it like this. As you see, all the keyframes are at the end right here. So then you can go back to the edit tab and shorten up the adjustment clip from the beginning. So now you can look at it, see if it looks good. Yeah, pretty good. Works just fine. Now we got to add the impact. Same thing, take an adjustment clip. Don't change anything about it, not the length, anything. And make this time so it starts at the impact like this. Uh, then again, just hover over it, go to the Fusion tab, and download the best impact preset. Drag it in like this, and connect that preset like this. Perfect. Now you're pretty much done, you can change the length now. And yeah, look at it. Like, subscribe, all that good stuff, and see you guys in the next video.